Try to make this video as fast and as quick as possible as I could. Like, I'm be leaving out a lot of stuff. It actually is not even, I ain't even making a tutorial. I just want to show you something. Because I tried making the tutorial and it's so much to explain. Uh, and maybe it's the way I talk, I don't know. But it, it just takes too long and I tried it with the, the little tripod thing here. And it was like exceeding four gigs, and I wasn't even halfway done with my what I wanted to tell you, and it, it's just too much. So I'm gonna just make, I'm gonna just show you what I'm, what you can do. Somebody out there probably make a better tutorial for you guys. I can't do it. Now, what I want to explain is you can you can download more. I mean, you can install more than one game at a time. Now, I was looking at somebody's YouTube video that they were showing me how to do it at one at a time. That's a very good video, by the way. But I just want to show you that there is a way you can do it uh, faster. I mean, you know, you don't have to do it one by one. Um, this is my Wii U here. Uh, I got quite a few games on there. Um basically use this program well like i said i'm not really making a tutorial i tried doing that man it was just i tried it with the tripod i tried it with the phone it's just it wasn't working out now uh man, focus in yeah then, then this problem the focusing thing i just hate making videos well i just i don't usually make tutorials or videos or none of that stuff i just figure out things and then i do it and then i wait and it'd be like weeks later and somebody finally put up a tutorial but i i usually be already on it um okay i got what i got something downloading over here what i got downloading okay got the angry birds over there downloading it was this espn game over here downloading now how i got those over there i don't even feel like explaining that i just want to know i would want you to know that there's a faster way uh let's see I got my game, okay. I got games copied over to my SD card, which is, if you look at this right here, it say copy the SD card. And these are the games I already got that I just showed you on my Wii U. Like say for instance, I want this game. Uh, this game has an update, which is right there. When you click on a game to start or downloading, it'll ask you, do you want the update too? You just hit yeah. The DLCs you cannot use. Uh, what else? Just hit yeah. Once it's done downloading, it'll go over here showing you that you already got it downloaded, and then you had you click on that game, you add it to your SD card. Uh, hit add to SD card. It'll pop up with this. Um, just I hit no. I'm very impatient. Um, hit okay. Got the game and the update. So you can I check both of those. And after checking both of those, I ain't going to do it now because I already got that game. It's going to start copying both the uh, the game and the update over to my folder, my directory that I created, which is right here. And when, it's, when it does the game, then it's going to do the update and it's going to add the word update at the end. And you can have a whole bunch of games. I had like 12 games lined up right here on my SD card. And see, in the other video, the uh, the guy said to open the folder and copy all these files to the folder that, you know, this install folder right here. And you don't have to do that. You can have every game inside of any folder, and it still works. Uh, which he, you know, it's not like he misguided you or nothing. He just probably didn't know at the time. And I'm just showing that you can. You can have them all in different folders. And I'm going to show you how to use those folders. It kind of explains it on the Wii U. Uh, but yeah. I'm going to show you. Okay. Let me see. Actually, there is a game that's done that I do not have. What game was that? Hmm. It was this. Yeah, this is it right here. Let me see if I can get that over to my SD card. I'm going to pause the video, though, while it's, while it's doing it. Actually, let me show you. Let me hit this. It pops up with this. I don't know. I'm gonna hit no. You remember I only had that uh, wonderful one-on-one. -on -one. I'm going to hit those, and we're going to hit that. And then that's the drive I got them in. So you want to double-click on that. 
and there it goes it's copying now I'm gonna pause it and wait for it to get done all right that is done with the game it should be about to be done with the game and then it should pop up now since it since the automatically started the next one which is the update look into my folder see that it did the game now it's doing the update Update's gonna go a little faster so I'm not gonna pause it I'm just gonna watch it mm, 25 seconds that's a waste of time I'm gonna pause it all right there we go almost done now it's done okay so we're gonna take this now remember you can add as many as you want just keep on adding and like in here like say for instance see I got these games downloading now if you go over here it'll show you the games I'm downloading now if I wanted another game I just scroll down like it's showing the games that I already have downloading are right there and they're gonna do them in order how you see them right there um say for instance I want another game let's go to something I don't have that I do want okay let's say Darksiders let's click on that and I'm just gonna hit add it don't have any updates or anything either so I hit add and it added it right there so you can just keep on clicking on all the games you want and it's gonna add it's gonna start downloading well it's gonna download of course one by one I mean you could down I think you can download in bulks uh, if you wanted to I'd rather do it this way but uh, doing it in bulks if you go right here at the bottom and say bunch and then hit you know add all all days or whatever maybe that worked. I don't know I didn't try it but I like it this way but um yeah just add a whole bunch of them and once they get done they're gonna be up here in green showing the ones that you have done now I don't really want to explain this let me see if I'm explaining this as fast as I could using the other program when I was downloading some of those games and I wanted those games to show up in here that I had already downloaded them what I had to do was change the name of those games they had to have IDs at the end of them so once you find the ID put it at the end or whatever uh, and they'll show up in there so you don't have to re-download them and stuff you, you saw all the games that you already got uh, this is my SD card that's not the one I want, meant to go to I meant to go to this right here these are all the ones I have on my computer sorry for the shitty video like I'm really not trying to make a tutorial I just I really just want to show you that you can download uh, I mean you can install more than one game at a time that's all I really want to show you uh, okay the SD card thing is done let me pause the video I gotta put the SD card inside of the uh, Wii U cuz like I don't have my Wii U out here I got my Wii U in the room and yeah okay I got my SD card in the Wii U now that's the Wii U down there next to the external hard drive that's where we're gonna be installing the games on and that's the TV that is in my room so let's see okay we're gonna look on the little pad okay so uh, we want to go and to show you yeah down there there's my uh, our drive you can have up to I'm not gonna show you that uh, I guess I, will. I don't want to show you that you can have up to a two terabyte I got a two terabyte hooked up right there you saw it okay you want to go to the exploit and there's plenty of tutorials out here how to do that so I'm not going to show you that just want to show you that you can install more than one at a time this already the video is already 10 minutes long and I, this ain't even a tutorial I was trying to do the tutorial I was at like 20 something minutes I, I can't do a tutorial not this one anyways uh, Right. now see right there where it shows the wonderful one-on-one see uh, I think the way the other guy was showing uh, it was only showing the ID it wasn't showing the name see this shows the name because we have it in the name with the ID now 
see it shows down here the you know press the d-pad to change the folder and all that stuff i was reading that i was like i was it seemed like you know we can do more than one at a time so that's what maybe try to go figure out how to do it now and we want to do it to the you know the uh, usb storage but like say for instance i want to do everything at once you want to hit the plus button because it says uh, hit plus to select all so down here you want to hit that plus button and it should show a star right after you hit it like that and if you go up and down okay that one's that. let's go up there we go that's the update see the update that's the game of that ESPN and that's the update I only put two because I'm trying to make the video short but you get the idea you can have as many as you want now I never really tried doing it all at once I'm pretty sure it works actually I'm gonna try it now the way I was doing it is I would only select the games first all the games now when I hit the select all I'll go through and, and uncheck the updates which I'll show you how to do that uh, okay this is the update here so if you hit uh, left it'll get rid of it it's unchecked and that's the game that's checked this is the update so hit left uncheck it and that's the game it's checked so then after that say it only shows the games not the updates it's checked on the games not the updates then you just hit X to install it to the uh, USB drive and when all the games got done then I did the updates. I went and hit select all and then uh, unchecked all the games and left the updates and did it that way. But now that I noticed that, um, that it, the, it, cause the reason why I was doing that, I was thinking, what if it installs the game or the update first and then um, try to install the game and then, you know, some files get overwritten. But when I went into the settings and I noticed that it has the update separate from the game it shouldn't do any over overwriting so that's why I think I haven't tried it I'm gonna try it right now though to uh, you know hit select all which is the let's go I'm gonna hit select all which is that so now all of them yeah should be checked and we're gonna go you know install to the USB I click that And of course, I'm not going to let you watch the whole thing. What I'm going to do is I'm going to unpause it when uh, it gets close to being done. Now, that's 10 gigs right there, so that's going to be a while. So, yeah, it is doing the game first. Um, so, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm going to wait till it gets close to being done. I'm going to unpause it and let you see how it looks when it goes to the next game. All right, be back in a minute. Alright, the game is pretty much done now, and I'm going to show you that it's going to go from that screen to that screen. It's going to come right back, saying we'll install the next part, which is the update, in one second. And it's doing this automatically by itself. There it goes. Now it's doing the update. Watch the update to go pretty fast. So I was, we sit and watch it. That's done. Now it's going to go to the next part. Which is the next game. They're saying that will start in five seconds. Well, one now. Mm, there that is. Mm, probably well, it's gonna go pretty fast that's a gig and a half look how fast it's going but just to save time I'm gonna pause it and wait till you get close to the end all right game almost done there it goes and that's gonna start two seconds one and that's the update. Update shouldn't be too big. So it should go pretty fast. It is. Mm, it's almost a 
It's a half a gig. I'm probably gonna pause it. Yeah, we're gonna wait. All right, there it goes. That's done. And that should have been the last one. But if you had like a whole bunch of them, it'll just keep on going. So as you saw, I did the game first, and then it did the update, which is pretty cool. So uh, that'll uh, eliminate what I was doing before, trying to do the, all the games first and then all the updates. So there you go. And then same as normal, hit the home button. Hit the home button again. out of there let's go check the games make sure they are not gonna ask for the update there they are let's try the one for one on one Usually a pop up already asking for an update. Didn't do it. And before I was trying to get those updates working and it wasn't working with the other program. I don't know if it was something I wasn't doing. I tried everything, but it works. This works. Um, I'm pretty sure the other one will work too. Now that I know how to do this, the other one will work too. I don't know what was going on, but there you have it. It's all working now. Right off the external hard drive. Let's go and test the other one. There you go, it's not asked for the update, so. Come on, let me go home. I know they wanna, the copywriting thing, I'm not supposed to show gameplay, but whatever. I mean, there ain't really no gameplay. Um, that's sort of. I mean, you can end the video right now if you want, but I just want to go and show you that all of them are on the X. External hard drive. That is here. Copy. You know, I had some stuff that was on my internal. And I moved it all over to my external. That's why it's now saying 25 gigs. I shouldn't have nothing in there. Yep. And that's my external. See, it was a two terabyte. Oh yeah, this is where I had found out that, I mean, I noticed that, you know, they install the updates kind of separately because, like for instance, this, let's click on that, see how it shows the update there and that size and then the game there, so it's not like merged together. That's why I figured, okay, maybe it won't do any overwriting. So yeah, that's that. That's all I have for now. Hope that helps. I know, like I said, this ain't a tutorial. Uh, somebody else out there will make the tutorial for you guys. I tried doing it, but it just takes too much time. I just wanted to show you that it can be done. So, uh, whoever wants to go out there and uh, make that tutorial for them, uh, go ahead and do it. Uh, have fun.